A former Waipahu High School business manager was sent to jail for 10 years today for stealing nearly a half a million dollars from the school. As KITV4's Moani Kiala Nabarro tells us, prosecutors say Warren Harada committed that crime for more than five years before finally getting caught. 62-year-old Warren Harada never looked up as he learned he'd serve a decade in prison after he failed to pay back nearly $500,000 in stolen funds by today. Last November, Harada pled guilty to purchasing technical equipment with Department of Education money, selling the items and pocketing the funds. Deputy Attorney General Christopher Young says Harada stole and laundered stolen funds over five years as high school business manager. There were over 200 items that were ordered, most of them very high-end cameras, ranging in the price from four to $7,000 each, and computers. Judge Richard Perkins ordered Harada pay back the $499,769.50 in stolen funds. Defense attorney Scott Collins says his client's Manoa home is currently in escrow and is unsure if he's able to pay the full amount back. Waipahu High School principal Keith Hayashi was new to the campus when he discovered checks and balances under Harada weren't adding up. Warren Harada did not only steal our money, he stole much more. He sullied the reputation of Waipahu High School and in the process the trust of our students, fellow co-workers and our community. It is unfortunate that somebody in his position, somebody with his background, was able to develop a scheme that defrauded the school in such a large amount. Prosecutors believe Harada stole about $800,000, but they could only account for about half a million. Reporting from Circuit Court, Moani Ke'ala Nabarro, KITV4 News.